it is uh, relatively straightforward to do a cathode that's uh, two thirds nickel, one third manganese, uh, which would then allow uh, us to make 50% more uh, cell volume uh, with the same amount of nickel. Batteries have long been the unsung hero of our digital era, but now their role is evolving and expanding into the electric vehicle sector. As the world searches for cleaner, more sustainable forms of transportation, these batteries are taking center stage. Innovative batteries promise to challenge conventional wisdom, delivering high energy density, improved safety, and fast charging capabilities. Not only are these incremental improvements, but also bold departures from the status quo. In today's episode, we'll bring you three notable battery technologies that the future EV is aiming for. So what are these battery technologies? Let's find out in today's episode of Tesla Car World. Welcome back to our channel. Before we begin, please show your support by subscribing if you haven't already and ringing the bell so you won't miss out on any of our interesting videos in the future. Now, let's get started with today's content. In this context, the importance of EV batteries for electric vehicle performance cannot be overstated. The following battery technologies will represent significant advances over conventional lithium-ion batteries in terms of energy density, safety, longevity, and cost-effectiveness. 1. New Generation Lithium-Ion Batteries The new generation of lithium-ion batteries is harnessing innovative materials and designs to achieve ever higher energy densities. One of the key advances in this field involves the use of a new cathode with a nickel compound and lithium-rich silicon anode material that increases the density of LIBs by up to 50%, more precisely is 333 watt-hours per kilogram, and the ability to charge from 10 to 80% in just 15 minutes according to the Tesla 4680 battery estimate. This is a significant leap forward in battery technology as higher energy density leads to longer range electric vehicles and reduced need for frequent recharging because of the many advantages of new generation LIBs more points and overcome limitations in its old version. These new generations of lithium ion batteries have a longer lifespan, reducing the overall cost of EV ownership as they require fewer replacements over the vehicle's lifetime. Today, among all the most advanced storage technologies, the new lithium-ion battery technology allows to achieve the highest energy density. Performances such as fast charging or temperature operating windows minus 50 degrees Celsius to 125 Celsius can be fine-tuned with a wide choice of cell designs and chemistry. Furthermore, lithium-ion batteries have an additional advantage such as very low self-discharge and very long life as well as cyclic performance, typically thousands of charges and discharge cycles. NMC or nickel manganese cobalt and NCA nickel cobalt aluminum are two of the most common chemicals used in this new generation of lithium ion battery technology. A notable example is Tesla's 4680 battery launching in 2022, a larger and more efficient version of the 2170 battery used in their current vehicles. The Type 4680 battery manufactured by Tesla is equipped with an NCM811 chemical cathode. Material characteristics show that the cathode has a nickel content of 81.6% and a cobalt content of about 12%. However, analysis of the anode showed that it contained no silicon. The active material at the anode is graphite. That was another surprise, as typically 10-15% to silicon is added to the anodes of modern lithium-ion batteries to increase capacity energy density. This is considered Tesla's intention to become a pioneer in dry electrode technology. While the 4680 battery boasts some impressive specs, you can only find it in a specific Tesla vehicle like the Model Y, which is manufactured at Tesla's factory in Texas. However, it is five times the size of the 2170 battery and even larger than Tesla's previous 18650 battery. Looking ahead, the 4680 battery is expected to be equipped in more Tesla models than just the Model Y. In fact, the plan is to install the 4680 battery in every model, including the upcoming Cybertruck delivery by the end of this year. Not only is it cheaper, but it also offers more distance on a single charge. These two factors make it extremely attractive to Tesla and its entire EV lineup. From energy density perspective, Tesla's managed to create a battery cell that's on par with some of the best battery cells being created today. 
So, what is expected of the 4680 lithium-ion battery? In fact, the 4680 battery has been produced and used in Tesla's electric vehicle technology. However, Tesla has always placed great performance on the 4680's ability to cut costs and deliver high performance. Plans to cooperate with giant battery manufacturers such as LG, Panasonic, or China's Cattle promise to bring the next generation of 4680 batteries with higher energy density of up to 118 watt-hours per cell. Lithium-ion batteries have long been the dominant technology in the electric vehicle market. Their relatively high energy density, durability, and performance have made them the top choice of electric vehicle manufacturers around the world. However, conventional LIBs are approaching their theoretical energy density limit. However, applying new generation lithium-ion batteries to electric vehicle technology always presents great challenges and comes with impressive prospects. The main barrier is the cost associated with the material used in these batteries, cobalt. The supply of this material has caused some major impacts on the environment, and especially the exploitation of cobalt mines seem to be exploiting human labor. Regardless, the new lithium-ion batteries will still lead the trend for a while before researchers find a new energy solution for the EV industry in the future. 2. Lithium Sulfur Batteries Lithium sulfur or LIS batteries present a promising alternative to lithium ion batteries in the future. These next generation batteries use sulfur as the cathode material, which has a much higher theoretical energy density compared to the cathode materials typically used in lithium ion batteries. This inherent advantage provides LIS batteries with exceptional energy storage potential. One deciding factor is that sulfur is the 10th most abundant chemical element on Earth, so it's in abundant supply on the market. And when you look at lithium sulfur, you say, well, there's a lot of sulfur out in the world, and it is very, very cheap. A commercial lithium sulfur battery could make electrification something that is abundant, where it is easy to electrify everything, said Selena Mikolajak, Chief Battery Technology Officer at Startup Lighten. According to market research data on fourth quarter of this year, the cost to get one ton of sulfur is just 108 bucks a ton. For comparison, you can get 280 tons of sulfur with the same amount of money that can buy one ton of cobalt. The researchers say they've optimized production costs so that the lithium sulfur battery costs six times less than Tesla's current 4680 battery. It's only about $17 a kilowatt hour. The use of sulfur in batteries could provide a theoretical super high energy density or the amount of energy a battery can hold on a single charge. The lithium sulfur battery is capable of providing an energy density of over 600 watt hours per kilogram. Today's EVs can drive about 300 miles per charge, but lithium sulfur batteries have the potential to double that range or create an EV that's half the weight of the lithium ion powered equivalent. With the idea that lithium sulfur batteries don't use cobalt, it eliminates barriers to environmental and human rights issues in cobalt mines. The abundant supply of sulfur makes the cost cheaper and can easily increase output. A number of early companies have actively attempted to commercialize this technology. Lighten is a California company that's been pursuing lithium sulfur batteries for years with significant support from the U.S. military. They have an ability to produce 200,000 batteries per year. That's a small number compared to the number of lithium-ion batteries produced commercially every year, but those prototype cells will be shared with potential customers in the military EV industry to test, investigate, and evaluate future commercial possibilities. They are being explored for use in aviation and even space exploration. Lighten's lithium sulfur battery technology can unleash the performance potential of sulfur by preventing polysulfide shuttle a damaging factor that shortens battery life and has prevented its use in lithium sulfur batteries in electric vehicles until now. During Department of Defense testing, the light and cell prototype design survived more than 1,400 charge-discharge cycles. This technology has the potential to revolutionize the electric transportation industry by providing batteries with unprecedented energy density and cost efficiency. However, despite recent innovations in funding, Lithium sulfur batteries still have a long way to go, but is being developed in laboratories around the world. The progress really takes more time. 3. Solid State Batteries Currently, any rechargeable lithium battery relies on two electrodes that exchange ions through a liquid electrolyte. This works very well, however, there is a downside. Some liquid electrolytes are flammable when abused or damaged. 
Therefore, this type of battery uses a solid electrolyte. This fundamental design change brings numerous advantages, including enhanced safety, higher energy density, and a longer lifespan. One limitation that is being noticed is that solid state batteries can be three to four times more expensive than traditional lithium ion batteries because they require high design and integration techniques. Solid state polymers and ultra thin ceramics, oxides, nitrides, sulfides used as electrolytes are very sensitive and difficult to produce. Additionally, solid state batteries still have to use cobalt and practically all electric car battery manufacturers are facing the risk of a cobalt shortage today. However, it has many advantages compared to the previous two battery models that we analyzed. Because the electrolyte material in solid state batteries is mechanically resistant to higher temperatures, this makes the separation between the anode and cathode more reliable, to the point that it prevents short circuits even in case of misuse or damage, and thus the intrinsic safety of the cell is increased. According to the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, or NASA, solid state batteries are capable of storing 500 watt hours per kilogram. Higher energy density results in increased range of more than 750 miles on a single charge and provides better performance for electric vehicles. Solid state batteries can be charged faster than conventional lithium ion batteries, with a charging time from 10 to 80 percent in just 10 minutes, as announced by Toyota. A Japanese automaker with the goal of launching a new EV will run entirely on solid state batteries in early 2027. Additionally, solid state batteries are less sensitive to temperature changes, allowing them to operate effectively in harsh conditions. Currently, many electric car owners complain about poor vehicle performance in cold weather conditions. Specifically, the operating range is shortened, the battery charge is slower, and the vehicle runs weaker. These problems are believed to be due to lithium-ion batteries having an ideal operating temperature range of 10 to 30 degrees Celsius. Many EVs seem to be suffered in the cold winters of North America or Norway. On the contrary, published scientific studies show that solid-state batteries can operate effectively in a temperature range from minus 40 to 170 degrees Celsius. Several companies are actively developing solid-state batteries for a variety of applications including electric vehicles. Previously, extending the life of solid-state batteries was an issue that made this battery technology unfeasible for commercialization. But in the end, Toyota claims that they can solve this challenge to remove the barrier. What follows in developing mass production capabilities will have an impact on the landscape of the EV market. In addition, Nissan and BMW also have plans to bring EV technologies using solid-state batteries by 2030. Startups like QuantumScape are making significant progress in commercializing solid-state batteries for automotive applications. When will solid-state batteries be available on the market? Despite many advantages, solid-state batteries still face challenges in terms of production and scalability. Saving costs on solid-state batteries is still a complicated task. Solid-state batteries will emerge as a mature technology in about 8 to 10 years when their combination of low-cost, high-energy density, low weight, and long life will be ideal for electric vehicle and energy storage applications. What is particularly interesting is that solid-state technology is ideal for a pouch cell format. This offers the flexibility to move away from the traditional cell. Instead, we might be able to create batteries on a single unit that forms an integral structure element in a vehicle or aircraft. If the good progress made so far continues, then we'll see a slow but substantial shift to solid-state batteries. And one day, they might even replace lithium-ion batteries everywhere, with the exception of special high-power applications. The automotive industry is undergoing a profound transformation driven by the growing popularity of EVs. As the demand for electric vehicles continues to rise, battery technology plays a pivotal role in shaping the future of electric mobility. New generation of lithium-ion batteries exemplified by their higher energy density, improved safety, and longer lifespans. Prominent examples, like Tesla's 4680 battery cell, are already demonstrating the potential of this technology, offering a promising pathway for electric vehicles. Lithium sulfur batteries, with their exceptional energy density and lower manufacturing costs, promise to revolutionize electric transportation. Meanwhile, solid-state batteries with their enhanced safety and performance are poised to lead the charge in the electric vehicle industry, offering improved range, all aimed at solving the limitations of conventional lithium-ion technology and creates energy diversity for the electric vehicle industry of the future. Finally, 
How impressive are these battery technologies, and what kind of batteries would you like Tesla to use for future products? Let us know what you're thinking in the comments section down below. And if you had a blast watching this video, show us some love by smacking that like button, subscribing, spreading the word, and smacking the bell icon to get notified of more exciting episodes. Thank you so much, and until next time, stay safe and God bless.